We're up here about 10,000 feet, enjoying the wind-blown, packed uh, fat bike trail of Dry Gulch. This is uh, one of my favorite downhills around. Um, pretty sketchy get, getting into it a few days ago. We'll see what has changed, if any. The idea is to keep good momentum and stay on on the pack trail which is pretty hard to see and how do you like this? This is awesome! Can't go too fast due to the conditions of the trail. It looks like there might be animals around here. This area gets a lot of use by moose. Let's open it up a bit. tracks coming down here well you can still see them to my left well, these corners are a little bit sketchy but still that makes this descent awesome and go to the bottom So here we are at Peabody Placer. We're gonna head up to hit Upper Flume. So now we're on the flat section of the Upper Flume. Uh, this flat, flat section goes for about a half mile before it drops down. Looks like there's a moose track here. So the animals are using these trails too. To my left is the upper flume. This is going down to Thomas, baby. There's a surprising tight turn there. Here's a bridge. This is pretty cool. This is where most of the descent happens here. You can pick up some good speed. and pull it back down for the corner. And we're close to Tom's Bay right here. Cue down as always for these corners. We saw that bag on the trail. That's full of dog crap. Enough about the dog crap, let's get back to the trail. This is absolute sweetness through here. Don't want to hit it too fast or too hard. But these tires have quite a bit of grip. You'd actually be really surprised.
but you don't want to overcook these trails or else Here's a parking lot, short but fun section of trail. And now it's back onto Peabody Plaza.